Hey folks, we're going to do a video today on uh, the solar panels, I, other solar panel I put up yesterday. <clears throat> if I cough during this video, I got a bad cold. But anyway, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, so we're producing a pretty good sunny day today. The conditions are really good. As you can see, partly cloudy, but mostly a good, clear blue sky. And I'll show you what we're producing. All right, let's see. Let's see what we got, y'all. All right, here we go. But yeah, here's the uh, the panels. The new uh, that's the the original the other four I have put up. And here's the fifth one, right there. But yes, yeah, we're it, they're doing good. They're putting out plenty of power today. Plenty of power. Yep. All right. We'll go down here. I'll show you my wiring job. Everything's pretty much, uh, I say, tucked underneath there pretty good. As you can see, things up underneath there, nice and nice and snug. And pretty neat. And there's some more. Y'all can see that or not? All in series. It's five 140 watt panels tied in series. And you got one, uh, two cables coming through the this conduit, which is a negative and a positive. Positives down there, right here, where I get the red. See the red? Okay, that's the red coming on that end. And that is the the yellow. I got it marked in yellow. That way I can tell it is uh it's my negative. And that's coming right into my combiner box right here. Into my combiner box right here. I got two wires, negative and a positive, going through here. And that's all I got. I got one 50 amp breaker going through here. And here's my ground. And here's my other ground. I saw a copper coming out of the combiner box. And there she is. And it goes down to my ground, ground lug. Hey. Down there. All right. And here is my lightning charge protector. In case electrical interference or anything is in the area with the uh, uh, like the thunderstorms and surrounding area and stuff like that. Right, let's go take a look from the distance. These panels are at 45 degree angles. I'll switch them. Um, at, at about February 1st, 45 degree angle for the longitude and latitude area where I'm at here in Virginia. Same way with that one, that's at a 45 degree angle for the month of February. Alright. And did you know that this is the same month, February would be the same thing as October. Same setting as solar panels would be in October. But uh, we're making plenty of power today. A little off grid system. It's making plenty of power. These solar panels, each 125 watt UL solar, are making plenty of power. And the solar air heater, you can hear they're running. That's pumping out the heat. It's a fan blowing in there. All right. Cassie, don't bark. There's my little doggy. Cassie. All right. <laughs> Cassie, you're going to bark when I'm going on the side of the fence. Now, right here, Cassie. Right here. But here's, here's the garden. Cassie, hush. And here's what we got. 
five panels. Let me get up on top of the roof. Let me get on top of the spot. One second. I don't want my neighbor's stomp pig. Alright, here we go. Woo! We got everything in the picture. Alright. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Those two are there. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven panels up on the roof. That is neat, y'all. Then I got those two over there, which would be thir uh, 13. And these two, 15, and two on the back. Uh, two more on the back makes 17 panels altogether. All right, let's go check out the uh, inside power production. All right, y'all bear with me. I'm gonna do the survivor guy. Yeah, but man, y'all, I'm telling you one thing, the solar is well worth the money. Plus at the end of the year, you get a 30% tax credit on your stuff that, you, that you're doing. Well worth the money, I'm gonna tell you, it's well worth the money. If I had to do it all over again, I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Solar and the wind, well worth the investment. I'm right here. <laughs> Dog. Like a, like a kid. She's so sweet. She's a miniature, miniature shelter. There she is. Hi, Cassie. Huh? <laughs> She's something else. Alright. But anyway, yeah, we're making plenty of power today. Oh, it's all good. Now we're going side to power reduction. It's noisy as heck in here. Fans blowing and the solar air heater but it's it's warm in here i tell you that it's, it's definitely warm uh switch hats whoops sorry about that y'all but yeah it's uh power production is awesome today But well, anyway, here's what we're producing today. This is like adding new panels. New panel. Uh, right now, we're at 82 volts at 460 watts at 17.4 amps. Uh, all right, here's what we got coming in. 5.9 amps or 6 amps. 82.8 volts and these are just five up there that I got up there now today we made seven seven watt 700 watt hours so far and it's, it's, this isn't it but uh 11 o'clock y'all so it's gonna, it's gonna go more and more as the day goes on okay and here's the other here's the other charge controller other flex max 80 and this is what we're doing right now there we go. this is what we're producing like glare on there in the y'all that's better that's a 24 volt set of arrays 1610 all together on that Today we produce some of these two watt hours, 2,000 watt hours, one, or 1 1.9 on that set of rage. I'm putting out 1,080 watts. Yeah, that's, that's how she is doing. All right, another look at this one. It's doing really good. I'm going to look at this other one right here. All right, and here's what we're, uh, we're producing with both panels. One 
thousand twelve hundred watts going back into the house. Increasing one thousand five hundred and forty watts at fifty nine amps. And at twenty six hundred watt hours. They so far. And here is my um but in my on YouTube, Darren, he uh, told me how to set the sample for watts on um, the trimetric uh, 25, TM25, TM2025A, you know, producing 1500 watts, plus 1600 watts of power. Looking like a charm. Anyway, and I got my old buddy up here. You leave him out. Leave me electric. Any questions or anything you want to know about solar and wind? Contact that guy. Larry Lehman. Good people. Uh, there it is. And also, I want a special thanks to Alt E. So I get all my stuff from. Alt E store. Just ask for Bramley Munns. He will hook you up. Best deals around. This is a making renewable energy, making renewable doable. And they got classes and everything on there. Great, great store. Love it. Okay, y'all. Thank you for watching my video. And some five. Over and out.